welcome back to my channel. So today I thought I'd share with you a quick trick uh, to make hooded eyes look less hooded. Um, now, on my eyes at the moment, I have uh, put concealer just to get rid of any uh, redness, a eye primer on top of that um, to make sure the eyeshadow lasts all day, and then I put um, a thin layer of um, uh, just a a skin coloured eyeshadow and then I put quite a lot of mascara um, and I quite like this sort of natural look with a coloured lip um, but I do think that it can um, high, not highlight but you can see that I have slightly hooded eyes with this look because I haven't sort of defined the eyes more so um, that's what I'm gonna do today um, and it's quite a, a quick, quick and simple process. Um, and I'm just going to use a, a medium brown coloured eyeshadow. And I'm going to apply it with a, a flat medium brush. And then I'm going to blend it with a blending fluffy brush. Um, and I'm going to apply this um, medium brown eyeshadow to the crease of my eye and just slightly above and then in the outer corner and um, yeah just making a sort of a V shape here in the outer corner and then into the crease as I said and what this will do is sort of push push that area back and therefore it will make the eyes all look less hooded um, because this sort of skin won't look like it's sort of protruding down and forward it'll be pushed back with the darker eyeshadow um, and make sure that you use a, a matte eyeshadow um, otherwise if you're using like a, a any eyeshadow with a shimmer in it it'll just sort of highlight that area and that's the last thing you want to do you want to push it back um, to kind of minimize the appearance of the hooded eye Okay, so I'll just get some some of this medium matte brown eyeshadow on my brush, tap off any excess, and then just apply it to the crease. And then I'm gonna take um, the eyeshadow to the outer corner. Just make sure that joins nicely. And then I'm just going to take my blending brush and just make sure there are no harsh edges. And I'm just going to um, apply one more layer um, just to make sure that lasts. Take my blending brush. The trick with blending is to be um, light handed with the brush. Let the brush do the work for you. Um, and it's as quick and simple as that. Um, hopefully you can see um, a bit of a difference between both eyes now. Um, when looking in the mirror here I can definitely see myself that this one looks more hooded than this one now um, and can't really tell that I'm wearing a lot of eyeshadow on this eye it's just sort of taken away um, that sort of hooded eye um, yeah just made it look less hooded I guess um, yeah you could sort of take this look much further um, and make it more dramatic um, but still use the same sort of um, technique um, in putting the dark, darker colours in the crease and the outer corner um, if you wanted more of a dramatic eye makeup look um, but if you want to keep the eyes simple and you just want to sort of minimise that hooded eye um, look um, then yeah this is one way of doing that 
Um, I hope this was useful to anyone with uh, hooded eyes. Um, yeah, and thank you for watching. Expecting it to um, look a bit cakey throughout the day. Um, but it doesn't. Um, I feel it's just 